the season of giving. So we're highlighting some local nonprofits who could definitely use a little bit of kindness. Yeah, we're excited to do that. One of those is the Center for Women and Families. Their holiday donation drive mm -hmm. is happening right now as we slowly open up the shot and welcome in Elizabeth Martin, the president of the organization. Uh, welcome to the show. Thank you so much. I appreciate you highlighting the center. Yeah, we're happy to do it. Um, let, let's just dive in before we get to the drive itself. Can you walk us through the work that the Center for Women and Children do? Absolutely. So we are the state designated domestic violence rape crisis center for Jefferson County and the six surrounding counties. We have been around since 1912 providing these services to the citizens of these counties. We're open 24-7, 365 days a year. And excuse me, I said women and, and children instead of women and families. That's all right, because we also take men. We always want everybody to know that our name doesn't include everybody that we take, so we do take men, mm -hmm. we take anybody from the LGBTQ plus community, mm -hmm. we take immigrants. So anyone who has experienced domestic intimate partner violence and sexual violence is welcome to the center to receive services. Thank you for flagging that. Yeah, that is so important to note, especially with some of the misconceptions maybe around Absolutely. domestic violence. Now, Elizabeth, you all do take donations all year round, but we know that right now for the holidays, there's a specific focus on a couple of things. Right. Right. Um, we have two big drives going on. The first is the is um, gift cards. Mm -hmm. One of the ways of that we see our survivors being abused regularly is through financial abuse. Mm -hmm. They don't have the ability to access money. They don't get to make choices around how their money is spent. And so one of the things that we always do at the center is empower the survivors that we serve. Mm -hmm. And that's through gift cards. So they get the gift cards. We, we give them to them. Then they get to buy the gifts for their family members, for their children. They get to make that choice. It's a form of empowerment that's really important to those that we serve. And how do people watching make that happen? Where, if someone has donations, where should they take them? They can bring them down to the center, which is at 927 South 2nd Street. Um, you know, come ideally between 8 and 5. Someone will be there to receive your gift. Make sure that also you get credit for that donation. And then we're also taking um, new unwrapped toys. And the purpose, again, of the wrapping is so that the, the women who are there, the fathers that are there, and they have their children, that they get to wrap those gifts. Right. Mm -hmm. They get to pick them out. They get to wrap them. They get to give them. Again, empowering people. Elizabeth, thank you so much for the work you all do, uh, not just at the holidays, of course, year round. Um, we are so glad that you are here and we'll want to give those details that Elizabeth was talking about to everybody. You can find all of the information on how and what to donate at thecenteronline.org. We will also post it on our website under the GMK tab for you.